Hey everyone, welcome back to Heartland Farms. It's a beautiful morning here in Michigan and we're gonna go collect our chicken eggs for the day. No eggs? No eggs. All right, let's go to the, the chicken coop then, okay? Alright, so it's a little later in the day, um, we have a giant stack of wood to move to stack and get that ready to be seasoned for this winter. Our neighbors were awesome and gave us some wood as like a thank you um, and they split it for us and it's absolutely beautiful. But we gotta get it from the yard against the house. this beforehand but where I want to stack the wood is gonna be really really weedy so not the area where I wanted to weed today but it has to get done so that's kind of how how things go on the farm you plan to do one thing another thing pops up instead So that took a lot longer than I expected, um, but we got it all pulled. I have the start of this tree right here and this tree as well that I have to dig out. So I have a shovel over here that I'm going to dig those out with. And then I'm going to lay the wood from the wheelbarrow all into here to kind of start stacking it. Um, I think in the future I would like to use this as um, like a flower bed. But looking at the soil, the soil kind of needs some TLC. So what we do right now is stack the wood here to get that aging, keep the weeds down. And then as the wood ages, it'll cause like bark and stuff. So it'll create its own natural mulch to fall in and encourage like worms and other bugs to get in there and help the decompos decomposition process. So hopefully we can start to kind of soil build this year. and Maybe next year we'll see. Um, this is poison oak. So I can't miss my time 
this um, past spring to pull those all off and kind of rid our house of it. Um, so I have to wait until fall when the vines dry up um, and that's just because it's the oil from those plants that gives you the poison ivy rash. Um, so I'll wait for that to kind of dry up and I can pull that off the house. Um, and then I need to trash can that. So yeah, um, let's, I'm gonna start digging out these trees. This is a lot harder than I thought. Because this right here, um, whatever this is, a stump, is holding up this whole wood pile, I'm just gonna kinda cut this down a little bit further right here. Take off like kind of the green and this weed and start stacking from there. I think it's gonna be a lot easier than risking this whole thing falling on top of me. So that took longer than expected, but hey, we got this whole area weeded. It's ready for wood, so I'm gonna start stacking right now. And I am on a timeline with wood because we need the wheelbarrow to go weed in the garden. As you can see, those weeds have grown up quite well too. 